Ere, and today is 20 May 2020, and uh, today my portfolio went significantly high, and it's mainly because of um, Steinoff. In the morning, this stock was, it opened at 99 cents, and so it went up to 1 rand 13 cents. So it went up by 14 cents as of now. So that's 14% up. And it's the stock that I own the most number of shares. So now it constitutes 60, uh, 57% of the entire portfolio. I sold some shares. I'll show you just now. And uh, today I opened at 239,000. And now I'm on 263,000. All right, I'm going to show you today's order book. Now, in this order book, you'll see I made, I tried to sell at, uh, at first, I thought, like, let me sell all my shares at 120 and make that huge profit. Because my average cost is um, 1 rand, is, is 1 rand 18 cents. So if I sell at 1 rand 20, I make 2 cents per share. Which is two cents times hundred and seventy one thousand literally now the other option i thought like i i went through my stocks and so which which stocks did i buy at less than 12 cents one one rent 12 cents then i noticed that um i had i think 30 something thousand shares that i purchased at uh, less than less than one rent 12 cents so i put it as the selling price and then some i put at 109 i bought those for one rand so i'm making one one what nine cents per share which is nine cents times three thousand so i made profit there i i haven't calculated to see how much exactly but yes there's some profit made but now the biggest thing for the day is the movement so I'll go to portfolio value summary. Okay, as of now, it shows that my portfolio went up by 22,150. So I'm in a better position now than I was this morning. So it goes to say, if you have a slightly bigger portfolio, you can, uh, you, you, you can see serious, serious movements there. Okay, so it's, it's slightly, it's 12,000 above quarter of a million so if i if i keep doing what i'm doing here i'm 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 definitely going to reach three hundred thousand very soon so what i'm doing now now what i'm hoping for is a drop in steinoff but it seems it it keeps going up okay so going down is good for me going up is good for me let me explain why if this stock continues to go up I'm going to sell at a higher price. Now, if it goes down, the same number of shares that I sold at one rent twelve cents, I can let's say if it closes at ninety nine, I'm going to buy way more shares than I had before. So right now, I think I want the dropping more than the going up. So I want this stock to go down so that I buy. But if it happens to go up, I might as well sell at a profit. The reason why I buy and sell this stock is it's not a dividend paying stock. So it doesn't really help to keep it for a long time because it's too volatile. And so that way it becomes a bit more uh, risky. Now, if you're owning a dividend stock, and then it goes down, uh, you might not really care that much because you still get dividends. But now, if you buy a stock and it doesn't pay out dividends, then the only reason you're buying that stock is capital gains. So you want the stock to go up, and uh, if it does, then, you know... Okay, so you see now it's up again 2,000. So maybe if I go to portfolio value summary it's going to show me 24,000 there you see very just um, two minutes ago it was 22,000 so it's it's going up 
and I actually want it to go down, but it's okay. Uh, the, the entire portfolio is getting bigger and so on. So now as this happens, uh, my eyes are now on any other stocks that are still low, like PPC. Since I sold, I have 41,000 cash. Uh, in the morning, I didn't have cash. So this cash comes from selling Steinoff. So I can use this 41,000 to increase my holding in other stocks. But now, since I'm having this thing that uh, I want Steinoff to go down, then I can buy it. So I can actually hold on to this cash. I'm not going to buy anything. All right, so I'm just going to make... Uh, this video this short and I'll be making another one you know when when I've decided what to do with the 41,000 thank you so much for watching I'll see you in the next video